before you leave your house in the morning. If you are the type that you always lack money, you find it very difficult to save money. No matter how hard you try, you cannot save money. Rub this on your palm and speak this three times and see what happens. Rub this on your palm so that money will stay in your hands. One, money will come to you. Two, that money will stay in your hands. There are people, even if that money comes, it does not stay in their hands. They end up spending unnecessarily. They end up overspending. At times, the devil brings sickness, brings evil, brings problems, troubles that will take away your money. Because of this, you cannot save. Any money that comes to you that you waste on sickness or any other thing cannot grow you up, cannot expand you financially, cannot expand you financially. So do this so that money will start staying in your hands. Do this to attract loss of money. You will never be broke again. Break out of that financial imprisonment. The enemies have tried to put you because it is not of God that you cannot save money, that money does not come to you, that your work does not bring enough profit. Because it is not of God that with all your effort, money is not coming to you. God's plan for us is for us to succeed. That is God's plan for us to succeed in all that we do. Okay, so this is what you will do when you wake up in the morning. You can do this any time of the day, in the morning, in the evening. Though I do this mostly in the morning before I go out, but at times I can do this in the evening. When you wake up, you praise God, you worship God, you thank Him for all He has done. Always learn to worship God, always learn to praise God. Be grateful for all he has done. Then when you are done with that, you ask for forgiveness. Then you say your normal prayers. Then you get that anointing oil. Anointing breaks the yoke. Just get olive oil. Take this to your pastor. Any ordained man or woman of God, your bishop, your reverend father, your priest, let them bless it. In all churches, they have days that they bless things, whether oil or Bible or candle. Get your things blessed by men of God, okay? So when you are done, you open your anointing oil and rub on your palm. Add a drop here. Mine is finished. Add a drop here. And rub it. I soak my palm with the blood of Jesus. I soak my palm with the blood of Jesus. I soak my labor with the blood of Jesus. I soak my effort with the blood of Jesus. I soak my effort with the blood of Jesus. I soak my palm with the blood of Jesus. I soak my palm with the blood of Jesus. Every evil chain that is holding me in the kingdom of darkness is broken in the name of Jesus. Anything evil that the enemies have done to stop money from coming to me I destroy in the name of Jesus. By the reason of the anointing of the Lord, let every evil chain, let every evil plant of the enemies in my life, in my finances, that is keeping me poor, that is draining my finances, be destroyed in the name of Jesus. From today, whatever I touch shall be blessed. From today, whatever I do shall be blessed. Then draw your palm close to your mouth. My palm is blessed. My effort is blessed. This hand will count lots of money. Money will stay in my hands in the name of Jesus. Money will stay in my hands in the name of Jesus. Every spirit of wasted effort, I reject you. Every spirit of wasted effort, I reject you in the name of Jesus. Anything causing me to waste my money, Everything done by the devil that is causing me to waste my money, that is bringing sickness and problems whenever I expect money. Oh Lord, destroy it and remove it from me. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. 
whatever is draining my finances, I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Anything evil draining my finances, I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Everything evil blocking my financial growth, blocking money from coming to me, I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Everything that is blocking my growth financially, everything that is keeping me poor, everything that is stopping my wealth, oh Lord, I rebuke it. I soak my effort with the blood of Jesus. No more wasted effort. No more wasted effort in the name of Jesus. No more wasted effort in the name of Jesus. No more wasted effort. In the name of Jesus, whatever I do, I shall prosper. I speak fruitfulness into my finance. I speak fruitfulness into my life. In the name of Jesus Christ, nothing will stop my growth again. Nothing will stop money from coming to me again. Nothing will stop my abundance again. I will no longer walk and remain poor. I will no longer walk and be begging for money. From today, let there be fruitfulness. Let there be abundance in my life. Whatever I do, I shall prosper. I plead the blood of Jesus upon my efforts. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus upon my efforts. Upon my words. In the name of Jesus. From today, listen to me, you shall count money. From today, you shall hold money. From today, you shall save money. From today, you shall invest money. From today, you will no longer waste money. You will no longer spend money on sickness and evil. In the name of Jesus, my financial life is covered with the blood of Jesus. My financial life is covered with the blood of Jesus. Nothing will block money from coming to me again. Nothing will block my wealth again. Nothing will block my abundance again. Nothing will block my success again. In the name of Jesus, no more wasted effort. I soak my hands with the blood of Jesus. I soak my hands with the blood of Jesus. I speak fruitfulness upon my hands. I speak fruitfulness upon the work of my hands. Every work of my hand shall be fruitful shall be profitable in the name of Jesus. Every work of my hand shall be profitable. Anything I do with my hands from today, anything I do for a living shall bring loss of money, shall bring abundance, shall bring abundance. Every cause that is working against me be broken in the name of Jesus. Let every cause be broken. Let every cause be broken. Let every cause be broken. Every cause hindering my growth is broken. Every cause stopping money from coming to me is broken. Everything evil done by the enemies to keep me stagnated, to keep me poor, to keep me broke. Oh Lord, destroy that cause. Stop them, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, I call forth fruitfulness. I call forth abundance. I call forth blessing. I call forth wealth in the name of Jesus. My effort will yield loss of profit. Every seed of wastage planted in my life by the devil is uprooted in the name of Jesus. Every seed of fruitlessness planted in my life is uprooted in the name of Jesus. Every seed of failure planted in my life is uprooted in the name of Jesus. Every seed of wasted effort is uprooted in my life in the name of Jesus. Blessing shall come to me. Favor shall come to me. Abundance shall come to me. Money shall flow to me. All my effort shall prosper. All my effort shall bring sources. All my effort shall bring sources. In the name of Jesus, everything I do shall prosper. Everything I lay my hands upon shall succeed. All my effort shall prosper. Everything I do, I shall make it. Everything I do, I shall succeed. Everything I do, I shall succeed. In Jesus' name, amen. This is all you need. I begin to speak anointing. Anointing that breaks the yoke of poverty fall upon me. Anointing that breaks the yoke of poverty fall upon me. Anointing that breaks the yoke of the enemy fall upon me. Anointing that breaks every spell, every curse fall upon me. In the name of Jesus, I release my finance from every spiritual bondage. 
I release my finance from every spiritual bondage. I release my finance from every evil prison. I receive financial freedom. Money will stay in my hands. I will never lack money again. The Lord is my shepherd. Because he's my shepherd, I will never lack money. I will never lack growth. Everything will work for me perfectly in Jesus' name. Amen. I soak my hands with the blood of Jesus. I soak my efforts with the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. When you are done with your prayers, you go out. If that is morning, if that is evening, then you go to bed. Do this every time or do this once in a while as your spirit leads you. So that money will come to you and that money will stay in your hands. Because one major trick of the devil is to drain your finances, to keep you poor, to make sure even if money comes to you, you will not use it for something good. That is why when money is coming, sickness comes. Everything evil and negative comes. So do this. And all of those tricks of the devil will never stand in your life again. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you have not. Give this video a thumbs up. Share with your friends.